What is going on guys, Son of Beast here. We're back for another NBA Finals on 2K21. The Sixers against the Suns as the Suns are in the lead 2-1 over the Sixers. It seems like the Sixers haven't gotten a chance to bring it back yet. Well, there might be a solution for them if they wanted to keep it going. Let's see how well they do if they can try to keep it up with the win. If they can pull it up through. And also here's the best of season seven and also with 2K of seasons. Uh, I am huge on my career. I played my career. In episode 29 of the season, which teammate did Jason Tatum says he wants to dunk on? I'm a believer in letting little kids win. So like my little cousin DJ, he gets mad at me all the time because I beat it. I know you have some favorite teams, some favorite players. Tell me about those. I have teams that I love depending on no, this season. <laughs> Are you a fair weather fan? Yes, Are, I or, no, yes, what do they call them? They call them. Um... I'm a bandwagon. <laughs> I'm a proud bandwagon. I really am. This is a tough question, but who's the best my player of all time? Free. Free. Uh -huh. <laughs> Here's one, the next one. In which episode of the sixth season did they air on first 2K TV Ernst the World segment? The best chase. How are you doing? Hey, man, 18. No, it's not always episode 41. If you guessed it, then you're all wrong. It was episode 39 that they did it already. So, not just the best one that we are looking for, but that is just hard that we are looking at. It's very hard to understand the question, but this is not the only best one that we are looking for. Me and you sing? We can, I could sing too. And now here's the question. We've got some topics. Which 1996 NBA All-Star did they interview in episode 19 of the season? <laughs> Why don't you try? <laughs> now, if you're looking for if you're looking for the interview of Shaq O'Neal, you're wrong. It has to be somebody else, not this guy. Oh, okay. It's a part of the thicket. And here's the last one. This guy's like a trick room. Huh? Here's the one we'll be talking about. Now, who was the winner of our shoot creator challenge this season? Which one is it? Put this on so you can have a disguise. So, hey, that's a girl that If you know the answer, the leave the comments down below. Mom, what's Nickin? <laughs> All right. We'll do some best of each of uh, each season of episode. But we'll be back here shortly soon in game five. Time for the commentators to bring it in. Here are the Phoenix Suns starting lineups. This is for Zero Leaches, number 99, Jay Crowder. Number four. This is for Zero Leaches, number 25, McCall Bridget. And in the middle, this is for Zero Leaches, number 22, DeAndre Aiden. Number three, Chris Paul. And she burns number one, Devin Booker. And your head coach, Bernie Phoenix Suns, Monty Williams. Welcome, folks. Thanks for tuning in to 2K Sports for 
the latest presentation of our NBA basketball. Hi everyone, this is Kevin Arlen. Joining us tonight, Greg Anthony and Hall of Famer Doris Burke. And Doris Burke is going to be able to do it on Game 4. Here's DA. Kevin, thanks very much. The Phoenix Suns have struggled the last few years, but they're trying to build a winning franchise again. And their all-star Devin Booker said, we want to see the city at a high level. That energy and aura. I've always said since I've been in Phoenix that I know the fans are there. We've got the support behind us. We just have to go and perform. Kevin, back to you. Well, they're getting closer. Thanks, D.A. Thank you. Now we'll look at some Starting lineups. Starting lineup. Key matchup, Ben Simmons, Simmons versus uh, Chris Paul. And Seth Curry against and Devin Booker. In at the small forward position. And for Phoenix, Booker and Bridges are the wings. Jake Crowder out there with Aiton. And it's Paul in at the point guard. Tell Doris it should be an interesting matchup in the low post. How do you see the battle of the bigs? Here is Doc Rivers, along with uh, Monty Williams. Able to look for his win. Just going to see what he can do. We are in for tonight. Now that's more the exception than the north these days. I'll tell you what. Here we go. The Suns win. The Valley heads it up. To the inside. Here's Booker. Aiton, the pass to Booker. Kicks to Bridges on the arc. And Simmons with the rebound. That is fantastic. So commentators are on here tonight. Is uh, Kevin Harlan, Greg Anthony, and Doris Burke. I don't know whose uh, basket was it, but I'm not sure who, who that is. And so it's the 76ers getting on the board for goal, Bridges. Chris Paul. It's very hard to go this here at that point. Being consistent now. Here's Simmons. Here's MB. And tonight he sends it right off the glass. Well, D here. DeAndre Ian. Some nice ball movement here by the Suns. Breeze! Booker! Jay Crowder. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. The pass to MB. Second chance shot. And it's Devin Booker with the rebound. Yet another miss. Just one for five. Not exactly an ideal start. Back to Aiden. And MB with the block. Width plus agility. Great recipe for blocking shots. MB one Seth of the best Curry. to do it. Ben Simmons. Just over a minute and a half played here in this one. So we're here again. Paul passes it to Crowder. For the three. It's hauled in by the Almost had it. And you could tell he thought that triple was going to fall. Simmons with it. Ben Simmons. That is authority right there. It was. Wow, what a reaction here for the commentators. Looks like Ben Simmons was not even able to smoke it down in the center. That's the ball. Well, well, reaction here. He shoots the body here. And using his long arms there to his advantage. Opponents got to be mindful of Harris's defensive capability. Over in the corner, Green. There's MB. Banked in off the glass. Joel MB. Boy, his hard work on the offensive glass, earning an additional opportunity. Suns trail by three. Pass to Bridges. Now here's Booker. Out of bounds. Philadelphia the takes position. Philadelphia ball. Boy, not sure what happened on that one. Just an unforced error. And that was another look at the aggressive D that led to the mobile one block. Some intimidation right away. Got to show those shooters you're going to be there all night long. And so here is Philadelphia. About We're not done with this yet. The first quarter. We're going to keep an eye on it. Three finds and B. Over eight. And B, no good. Well, he's a quality mid-range shooter, but he can't get that one to go. And again, it's the Suns missing. And this quarter, he has clearly been off the mark. And Simmons. And Simmons. And 
This is how Simmons Timeout Suns. Points. He challenges you close at the rim more often than not having the physical advantage. And first time out of the game called for Phoenix. And momentum going the other way. Can, can they find some answers? I think here you have just got to get back to what you do best and then live with the results. So, as being said, the NBA 2K22, I am not sure when am I going to start the day, but I will keep an eye on here to do it on November, the day of 2021, but that will not change the effects as I will try to keep an eye on that time, um, whether I do this one or whether I do it the other one of in Anime Insanity Reaction. But there might be some schedules that I'll keep an eye on, plus the new show, uh, I will bring it up here, just to make sure if there's any changes at this point. So I will keep it, keep you guys uh, scheduled. Once September hits, I will keep an eye on the NBA 2K22, and I'll let you know right away. John Timmy's checked in for the Suns. Payne comes in for Paul. Checking in for the Suns, number 23, Cameron Johnson. And number 15, Cameron Payne. Johnson outside. Three! Kevin Johnson. Kevin Payne. Outside Curry. Back to Simmons. High post and B. I'll tell you, he has looked just a step slow all game, but his teammates, boy, have they come through. Booker in the corner. Feeds it to Green, to the middle, and MB. So all MB. Well, Danny Green Danny is so Green. good at recognizing when his teammates have open looks and putting it on the money. Nicely done. Green with it, to the right side. Now the pass to Johnson. Shot clock at six. Joel Embiid pulls it down. Embiid's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Down low and stolen by Eaton. Here's Bridges. Throws it down. We go, Bridges. That's on Ben Simmons. That shot's good for Phoenix Suns. Philadelphia foul number 25. On the way up to the basket, McCall Bridges solid at keeping his composure. The Suns shooting their first free throw of the night here. Shooting what? For Phoenix Suns, number 25. McCall Bridges. Matisse Thibel comes in for Green. Shake Milton, he's checked in for Seth Curry. And George Hills subbed in for Simmons. Wapal Colt might be looking for his time to, to shine. Greg, you've always said to have a winning team, you need franchise players. Talk about the specific qualities you look for in those superstars that can catapult a team to greatness. It's a great question, Kevin. Talent really isn't enough. You know, whether you lead vocally or by example, the agenda has to be winning, and your best players really... Two minutes left in the first period. ...is going to be, so the franchise caliber player is a... Suns foul number 22. DeAndre Ayton his first the half, foul. Letting the offense get to the rim. Shooting two at the free throw line for Philadelphia. Number 21, Joel Embiid. Phoenix Suns, number 22, 
DeAndre Ayton. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Last game, also previous uh, game for the finals. And he knocks down the first one. I think what you like most about DeAndre is probably the for the Suns, number 20. On the offensive end. Dario. Now, Sucks. obviously, the next step, he's got to raise his game and defensive intensity on that end of the floor. And the Suns making a change here. Charge is checked in. Aiton hits them both. Minute 50 left in the first quarter of the game. Walton the pass to Fiber. He feeds it to Embiid and taken away by Johnson. And here's Booker from the arc. Reed Evan Booker. Now part of that is recognizing the spacing. Aaron Johnson. Good at on the break. Defense. Here's Hill. Defense. Second chance effort, and the rejection by Aiton. A team's rebounding is a great measure of its energy, and theirs has been terrific here in the first quarter. The 76ers trail. And here now is Feibel. He's been patient so far, nothing on the scoreboard yet. And Howard with the stop. Dwight Howard. If you had a question as to how Dwight Howard is up there amongst the all-time leaders in offensive rebounds, that's an example why. Now here's Shorich. This is it to Aiden. 46 seconds left here in the opening quarter. And the refs are going to rule that unnecessary contact. It's a flagrant one foul. Boy, a, a very hard foul. That's a foul fragment the on the six here. And it's Philadelphia, number 39. Do you want Howard? His second. Gee, that's an easy call for the officials to make when there's that much contact. Shooting two at the free throw line, number 22. Those were in play. It's DeAndre Eaton. One falls for. We have a lot of fragments out there that also could have been a technical foul to be pointing it up. And without the penalty to be put it up by their team. And so he makes both from the line. Tory Craig, he's checked in for Phoenix. Checking in, in for Phoenix Suns, number 20. Pause, checked in for number 12. And Tory and Craig. For Shake Milton. It's not going to count. And even though, you know, you're thinking maybe we don't need the replay in a situation mm. like this, still plenty of time Let's left see what the very efficient game. replay is. It's about getting the call right. What's the official saying? And it looks like they got it right this time. No basket. The clock expired while the ball was still Ball is game. overturned. And even if they don't show it, I no shot for the Phoenix Suns. Right. Like, yeah, that's. Yeah, that's not going to work at that time, so, yep. So at the end of one quarter, that's the end of first. We'll be right back after this one of Game 4. And close game underway so far. We'll see if either of these teams can jump out in the second quarter. And from what we've seen, guys, from the Suns, uh, what are you thinking so far? Just stretching out the floor that first, uh, they had the defense scrambling. And that was obviously the plan coming in. Now the big question, can they maintain that efficiency from range as the game goes along? And a chance here presented by Gatorade to see who's on the floor. All fueled up and ready to go for the start of the second quarter. So on the floor. D.Y. Oh. 
Maxie, George Hill. Hill is out there with Maxie. Then there's Howard. And it's Cork Miles with the three slot. Paul goes in. Oh, and he whacks it off the glass. Wow. And Sharich kicks to Craig. Paul with the three. Rebound by the 76ers. Howard's got four rebounds in this game. And gotta like what they've been doing down low in the post. Got a hand on it. on the offensive end. DeAndre Aiden. The number gets called time and time again. Oh, it's Torian Craig. Dario yes, The homie, as he was known in Philly, a Croatian finesse forward for this team. You know what I love about Dario is here's a big man who can space the floor with his shooting. He can balance that with an ability to make plays off the dribble. He's a really sneaky cutter and a very opportunistic rebounder. I mean, this is a big man who will contribute in a lot of different ways. Yeah. Second shot opportunity and block. That one goes careening off the glass. How? Another miss by Philadelphia. And here's Sharnich. He'll bring it up for Phoenix. Only given up two points this quarter. Well, they have the advantage, but you still feel like this guy needs to find a way to get himself going. Took him no time at all on that one. Kortmaz has got his first bucket of the game, and he's on the board for three. Time out. So on call, the Suns. I mean, can you really compare players from completely different areas? I mean, people love to talk about the greatest of all time. You know, Kev, some players do transcend eras. There's no doubt about that. Wilt's a great example, and there are many others. But, but in reality, to your point, the style and the way in which the game was played was so different uh, that it isn't fair. All you can be is the best of your generation, or one of the best, and I, I think that should stand no matter what the conversation is. Like, there's no doubt in your mind, Oscar Robertson could play in this era as well as he played when he No doubt. Bill Russell, all those guys. Yes, the truly yes. great ones. So much of your ability to perform at a high level is built around your confidence and your belief in your abilities. And those Seven guys for the Suns, number 25. Nicole Bridges, along with so number 15. Cameron Payne and number 89, Jay Crook. And it's Payne in for Devin Booker. And the 76ers will go for a different look here. Tobias Harris is checked in for Matisse Thibel. Green comes in for Courtmoss. Curry's checked in for Maxi. And Chris Paul. Chris Paul not only has a great handle, but man, his footwork is so good. Outside Curry. In the second quarter, we played a little over two and a half minutes now. Lays it up off the glass. Curry's got six. And guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. Charge outside to the wing on the left. It's stolen by Curry. Side, Simmons. Over Sharich. Here's Howard. And he banks it. Dwight Howard. He has six. Now, Dwight Howard, if he gets that kind of position, turn the lights out. Sharich outside. And here in the second quarter, Matt Jones with the first four minutes play. And now, Philadelphia on the break. Here's Green, and he makes good on the Jenny lead. Green. And now a three-point 76ers lead. One easy look. Don't allow the defense to set up. What a beautiful fast break opportunity, and the finish pretty good. Outside Crowder. And that'll be two free throws. Philadelphia foul, number, number three, nine. D.Y. Hope is hurt. Make no 
Oklahoma State Crowder has got great strength in the uh, for Phoenix Suns, number 99, Jay. Two shots, coming. Number 99, Jay. Crump. Last year, for this group, was the fact that they were so efficient from the charity strike. That's a huge factor. Well, the first free throw is good. I just have so much respect for how Jay Crowder Checking plays. Checking in for the Phoenix Suns, number so 23. For every single Cameron Johnson. You love seeing that. Johnson, he's checked in for Dario Sharch. The 76ers also with a sub. Embiid's checked in. And both free throws good from Crowder. The 76ers have gone 5 of 11 from the field since the beginning of the second quarter. Simmons passes to Kirk. Here's Embiid. And a Joel Embiid. by Curry as that one goes Seth in. Curry. Eight points for Joel Embiid. They're finding lanes to the hoop now with consistency. Five buckets in a row from the paint. All against Simmons. Johnson right side. Over to the wing. Bridges passes to Johnson. The Suns need to get a shot off. Paul with the three. The shot comes out. Simmons with the defensive effort. I wonder what the score would be if they weren't controlling the back. And Simmons. That's the finish he'll be bragging about for a while. <laughs> As he should. Very impressive. How about that from your point guard, just playing big at the rim. Three! Chris Paul! Under two minutes, the first half. Paul with the steal, and here we go. Pass three. Paul's got it. And the Chris Paul. Hot like shot's good for the Suns. Don't know if you have foul number no forty-one. Seth Curry. Great house. first person for you that you had your number fifty retired at UNL. New changes for the Phoenix Suns. Number you know, one. Something, uh, can Devin I Booker. Say? Or Cameron Bay. About a lot of things. I the long one, you know, two throw, long. Highest levels. Uh, uh, one. I never really Chris Paul. To, to have your jersey hanging up in an arena. That was a surreal moment, a, a really cool moment, and it was awesome to be able to share it with my family and friends. And people probably uh, don't know that you grew up in Las Vegas, so it was probably doubly special, wasn't it? Exactly. Born and raised. But by Simmons. And Simmons. Yes, it counts. This guy is cooking right now. He is leading them on the offensive end as they remain in front here. Outside Crowder. Ball in Simmons. Here's Booker. Good. And Devin Booker. Booker's got four this quarter. Well, a guard has got to come with physical intensity on the interior, and Devin Booker does just that. Simmons finds Harris. And stand up. Elias Harris. No shortage of drama here early on. Yeah, eight lead changes already. Huge number this early. Booker outside. Three-pointer. Can't hit that one. So Philadelphia will take it the other way. He has that confidence rolling, hitting two threes in the first. Tobias Harris. And a nice mix of strength and agility. Harris able to explode to the slam. Johnson dishes to Crump. Back to Johnson. And it's Joel Embiid with the rebound. And Beach got rebound number 10 tonight with that last one. Shot clock and game clock separated by less than six seconds. Simmons passes to Embiid. Laid in with a Joel Embiid. Embiid ben got Simmons. the lead up to five now for the 76ers. They can close out the quarter if they want to. It's all about patience right here. Patience and execution. Get a good look. Crowder, the pass to Bridges. That's the end of the first half. Phoenix 34. So that'll be it for the Philadelphia 39. Battle underway in this one. 76ers lead by five.
and don't go away after the break. We'll be right back, uh, folks, after our halftime show. So far, neither team Time for the third quarter. Really much separation on the scoreboard yet. Joel and Bean has been sensational. Well, it didn't take him long to get that double-double. Already has it halfway through the game. That takes a level of aggression and a level of focus, and he has brought it all night thus far. The 76ers leading by five. Booker and Bridges are the wing. Andre out there with Jay Crump. And it's Paul Danny and Green. Who's out there for Phoenix. The plan of attack is obvious. Get the ball inside and go strong to the rim. And here's Booker from the arm. Three! Devin Booker! Control so far. Well, this is Devin Booker's specialty. Consistent at finding all kinds of ways to score from beyond that arm. Trying to break free. Nice so concentration to hit the double clutch layup. Man, have they been effective at getting the ball inside. For three, Booker. On three, the Booker. And Simmons has got the ball here for Philadelphia. It's a three point game. The ball's back loose. Here's Embiid, and the shot is long. Phoenix has gone two of two from long range in the third quarter so far. To the paint. Booker in the paint. Wow, what a start to this half. Three for three, dictating the pace on the offensive end. They're rolling early. Simmons against Paul. The drive by Simmons. Simmons. Simmons got sucks. And when Simmons is inside, forget about it. He uses his skill and smarts to take advantage. And the Suns call time here. And sometimes from the outside, not always clear what led a coach to call for a timeout. And as you know, it's what comes after that gives you some sense of what has changed. Give a little change up here. Let's make sure I have it out. Should be all in there, ready to go. And Phoenix making a change. And Summoned in for in. Phoenix Suns, and number 15. Checked in for the first ball. Cameron Payne. Here's Payne, and two free throws coming up. Unable to get that one to go. With oh, foul on, foul on Philadelphia, this number 25, Ben Simmons. His and he deserves a lot of credit for what he was able to do at the line of last year. Shooting two at free for a long strike. Renaissance, number 15, Cameron Pay. First free throw is good. This is about the last guy you want to send to the strike right now. They keep fouling him, and he keeps making them. Here's Simmons. Sweet little four. Ben Simmons. Simmons got four points now in the quarter. And at 6'10", a player like Simmons, to handle the ball the way he does, that's just unfair. Now, here's Bridges, defended by Feibel. Aiden inside, and Beads there, five to shoot, pulls up, high post, the Suns keeping it alive, a new 14, and it's blocked by Simmons. How about the balance and body control, Simmons able to send that one back. Now Payne, he dishes it to Crump, and Jay Carter. Important point there, Gary Payne. Payne. with it. Simmons inside. Ben Simmons. I'm amazed that 
Simmons' athletic ability. He moves so fluidly for someone that size. Pass to Crump. Poked away and stolen by Simmons. Uses the glass to and Simmons. Simmons got 16. By every time he goes up now, it just looks like the shot's going in. He's perfect from the field in this quarter. And Simmons. Ben Simmons. He's an absolute threat. Simmons is relentless in his pursuit to dominate really all phases of the game and improving with his heart. Bridges kicks to Crump. And the Suns miss again. And they hold a huge advantage on the backboard. Warriors Harris. And now a nine-point Philadelphia lead. And everything is dropping for them. Terrific second half run. And I think it's been all about their offensive efficiency. Breathe! Devin Booker. And you can just see his confidence. Devin Booker. I'm out of Philadelphia. They decide to take their first time out here. Johnson, he's checked See how well do. Tory Crane comes in for Bridges. Carter, he's checked in for Booker. And Paul subbed in for Cameron Payne. And the 76ers will go for a different look here. Mike Howard's checked in for MB. Torkmas comes in for Matisse Thibel. Oh, that was Ben Simmons. Yeah, whenever Simmons gets a chance to show off his insane jumping skills, he sees it. Here's Hayton. Oh, he's going to get hit with his second flagrant foul of the day. That's his foul for Philadelphia. Number three, nine. D. White Howard. It is for personal foul. He brought it on himself, though. Out of line, shooting two. Number 22, the, the officials not giving him any slack on the second one, but that usually is the way it goes. You know, once you cross the line and commit the first flagrant, there's a zero tolerance policy. We all know that when it comes to the next one. Here's what Philadelphia is going with right now. Joel Embiid, he's checked in for help, and Maxi subbed in for Corkmans. No good on the second free throw. He changes for Philadelphia, number 21, Joel B. number zero. Tyrese Maxey. Carter with it. I'm guarded by Simmons. From T. Johnson. Three! Curran Johnson. Second basket of the night. Devon Carter. To stretch the floor, particularly in this second half. And guys, boy, when you're hitting, it sure does work. It obviously opens up major options at the offensive end. And there's the pass to Maxi. And here is Hill. Six on the shot clock. Two minutes left in the first quarter. And beat inside. He's hit again. And the layup is up and in. Oh, and He's got 14 points for the game. They own the interior right now. Ten straight points coming from inside. Ball for three. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. And Beach got 12 rebounds here tonight. Big time effort. Here's Simmons. And the 76ers take on two more. And that bucket adds to what has been a big difference in points in the paint between the two teams. Carter outside. Foul pretty hard on that shot. Also a foul on Philadelphia. Number zero. Toby Specs. It's first personal. He's got his first team foul. Two shots. Two shots coming. Two shots on board. Number four. Javon Carter.
and the first one at the line is good. Katie Green, he's checked in for Shake Milton. Carter hits them both. The 76ers leading by six. Passes it to Maxi. And the shot goes. Tyrese Maxi. Maxi's got his first bucket in this one. They're doing a really good job of getting the ball inside and attacking the paint. That's an area they have completely dominated. Here's Paul. The shot, no good. Excellent D there from Hill. Philadelphia shooting about 59% from the floor offensively. They've been running without a hitch. And ben that one good. George Hill. Combo guard. He sees the floor and puts it on time and on target. Here's the three. Suns keep it alive. Back to Aiden. Three. DeAndre. Aiden. Cameron Johnson. From the triple. Four of their last five mates are from beyond the other. Johnson against Simmons. Ben Simmons. Slams it in. Just rubbing it in their faces with that <laughs> He is never going to take his... Calgary! What a catalyst for his... Chris Paul. <laughs> and no doubt they'd love to see him get a lot more of those opportunities. And that deficit will go away quickly if he does break. There's the three. Three! That's the end of the first quarter. Allows them to do just that. And so it's Ben Simmons making highlights for the Philadelphia 76ers. He's up to 26 points in the game now. Just keeps Philadelphia 67. Don't go anywhere. Sun 63. Final quarter coming up next after this one. Don't go anywhere. How about a look at today's State Farm assist of the game? Here you go. Here is the assist for the game for presented by State Farm. Watch one more time. That's what I call court vision. Well, making the game easy for your teammates. All about putting them in a position to score. That's pretty. They're pretty, but they're not that much better. Yours. Well, what a terrific game it's been so far with this fourth quarter. Sure to bring more pressure-packed basketball. So on the floor for Philadelphia. The young star, Simmons and Chris Ball. Curry is out there with him. And it's Green in at the three spot. I how about the ability to knife inside the defense. Chris Ball has been outstanding as a dribble driver his entire career. Ben Simmons. Slams it in. Just the kind of play they need in a game this close. You know, that's the kind of impression they want from their floor lead. Boy, and not just the aggression, the ability to get to the rim, but how about the finish with intention? Whoa! Pass to Kirk. And Bailey trying to break loose. Another shot and the call. On fouls the and fouls on the Suns. Number one, Devin Booker is first. Two and two for Philadelphia. Number 21, Joel Embiid. Pick it up! The free throw drops for Andy. Damn it, he had it in there. Checked in for Dario Sharks. And the 76ers Second also making a shot. Harris has checked in. Number 20. Who's we good? Number 99. Check. Crowder. And he makes both free throws. Suns trail by six. Ayton, the basketball book, takes the Devin end. Booker. Pick out the pass. Booker's got 13 points in the second half. And we played through about a minute here in the fourth. Hill passes to Green. Good, and it's Hill picking up the assist. Three. Danny Hill's Green. Five assists tonight. Uh, Danny Green is one of the best catch and shoot players in the league. Makes it look easy. Ball with the three. They get the rebound. The kick out to Crowder. Pass the ball. 
Suns moving the ball around. And here's Booker. Breathe! Booker! He's got 26 points. The defense is far too slow to close out on those three-point attempts. Hill vicious to Harris. Over in the corner, Green. Another three. Green ball. Danny Green. Danny Green. Last quarter of play, about two minutes in now. Eaton against Embiid. Here's Crowder, and he gets the whistle. Philadelphia foul, number 12, Tobias Harris. It's first. Crowder is not afraid to get physical. This guy will draw contact and get to the foul line. Soon to with the free throw line for Phoenix Suns, number 99, Jay Crowder. And the first one goes. Bridges is checked in for the Suns. Checking in for the Phoenix Suns, number 25, Nicole Bridges. He gets both from the strike. Here's MD. Harris outside. To Embiid, rejected by Crowder. Well, Crowder known for his defense, and you love to see him get high for these reasons. Tobias Harris. I love how he establishes his post position inside before he comes. This by Joel Embiid. And here's Booker from the arc. Three! Devin Booker. Paul's got his fourth assist. Chris Paul. Timeout call. Timeout, Timeout Philadelphia. Sixers are just trying to pick up a win here and take a tie series. But it may not be enough for them if they can keep it on the road. Well, there might be a solution out there if they wanted to keep an eye on it. So they better hit it fast. If there's any choice for them to keep it slow and, and pace it still if there is any chance. By right now, a new balance player of the game is going to be coming up next once the uh, clock is reaching down. We're going to find out what will happen at this point. If there's any chance for them to keep an eye on them. Song changes for Phoenix. Charge has checked in for DeAndre. Carter comes in for Booker. And Cameron Payne subbed in for Chris Paul. And Philadelphia also making a switch. Shake Milton, he's checked in for Hill. And keeping us updated from the sideline, let's swing it over to David Aldridge. Well, during the break, we'll listen in on Doc Rivers. Joel Embiid. He wants them to maintain their balanced attack. He told them they're doing a great job of finding space out in the perimeter, which has led to all those good shots. He likes the rhythm and the flow of this offense. He just told them, keep shooting it with confidence. Kevin? A pass to Payne. No good on the triple. Philadelphia leading by six. Outside Curry. Finish now to MD. That one good for Sounds two. Sounds good. You've well, got good. to admire the toughness that is. Sun foul, number 20. Dario Sarch is first. Shooting one at the free throw line for Philadelphia, number 21, Joel MB. Three and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth. Crowder feeling it out a bit. And he Jerry but Crowder. Crowder's got four this quarter. And now they're shooting it pretty well. That was not something we would have said in that first half. Here is outside. Shot from the wing. They get it back. MB. And the Joel Embiid. 
and Beach got 13 points here in the second half alone. You see that nasty streak in Beach. Breeze! He's gone. Of course. Offer no resistance defensively. He's going to knock down the three. I know, Philadelphia. And Philadelphia calls time here. And during this timeout, I'm sure they'll be hydrating themselves with Gatorade. All the effort out there on the floor. And these timeouts can be such a huge factor in getting a short rest and recharging the battery. New Balance Player of the Game. And now, let's present our New Balance Player of the Game, Ben Simmons. Hey guys, no doubt who our pick was going to be. Uh, he's made everyone else on the court look like they're playing at half speed. It's been total domination, and you can't help but just sit back and admire that performance. Johnson, he's checked in for the Suns. Outside. Listen, he was never he never been on a New Balance player in a game before. But thanks for him, he's on board and he's finally done it. And you get on Chris Johnson. Nicole Bridges! So one free throw coming up. That shot's good. More to Phoenix Suns. Phoenix Bells field foul. 14, Danny Bree. It's close. Shooting one at the free throw for Phoenix Suns, number 25, Nicole Bridges. One falls for Bridges. Well, we all know this young man came out of college highly decorated, having won two national championships. And in the NBA, but Kiel Bridges has shown those were not fluke. This guy's got big time talent. There's MB. Good and good. Well, indeed. Timeout sucks. Three assists in the game. When you think of Seth Curry, you're thinking shooting, but there, what a pretty pass to find the open man. Timeout call for Suns. Ben Simmons really making a difference here. He just keeps hitting shot after shot. They need to design a way to deny him the basketball. Make someone else beat you. Okay, pick and rolls. Let's pick up a limit transition. Let's make sure that everything is okay. Might be more of it than we need to do. And you can hear it on the other hand, the Philadelphia is making some rumbling down the downtown, across from the other section in the East Coast. They've got a lot of cheering out there, they're trying to pick up a tie already from the district of Philadelphia. A lot of stuff. Might be a lot of them going on. It's Payne with the ball. He'll bring it up for Phoenix. Trailing by five. And Sharich hits to Payne. A three from Johnson. Cameron Johnson. Cameron, hey. Two minutes, fourth quarter. Payne claims the board. Sons have gone here to the the final down the stretch. Mario Sucks. Cameron Johnson. Look at that. You can hear the crowd go wild out there. Playing fine from downtown. Now the defense is on. Inside. Here's Green. Danny Green from Simmons. Green has got a point here in this quarter. Now Danny Green has got such big time experience. He is undeterred in a big moment. Green kicks the car. Sarge passes the car. Such a clutch 
shooter. I mean, he lives with a big shot. And when he's rolling like this, watch out. The pain. That's it, five from 18. Rebound by the 76ers. They've led by as much as 10. Curry is inside. Defended by Curry. Son Smiles, number four, Tebow and Porter. Is first. Her team foul on his eyes. Shooting two. Free throw line for Philadelphia, number 41. Seth Curry. New changes for the Phoenix Suns. Number 22, DeAndre Eaton, number one. Devin Booker, and number three, Chris Paul. Pick up on the changes for Phoenix. Eaton, he's checked in for Sharks. Booker comes in for Clark. And Chris Paul is up in for Eaton. And so he drops the ball. It's a four point ball game. I need to tell you guys, those free throws are big two-possession game. Ball for three, and Joel and B pulls it down. Green dishes to Harris. Over Johnson, that's good from Harris Set. on the assist. By Tobias Green. Harris. And they needed that bucket, and leave it to Harris to go get it. He, he knows Harry Johnson. Work the ball inside and create a good look for your teammate. And they go to the intentional foul. That's a foul on the Phoenix Suns. Number three. First ball is first. Round two shot coming up. Number 25. Philadelphia. Ben Simmons. And that puts them up by five. The first pick in the 2016 NBA draft. Simmons has been a phenomenal addition to our league. And he cannot convert on the second pick. This is for three. Booker. Three. Devin Booker. Suns foul number four three. Chris Paul. That's the second. Shooting two at the free throw line in Philadelphia, number 25. Ben Simmons. It's the first, and that makes it a three-point lead. The Suns making a switch here. Crowders checked in. New changes for the Suns never. We're gonna die. Jay, Crock. So against them both, and it's a four point. Timeout Suns. Timeout call, the Suns. They're behind by four. Twenty seconds left to play here in the fourth. And you can hear the Suns, I mean the Sixers fans from this Philadelphia. They're starting to go excited because they're coming back here in game four and they're trying to pick up the tackle that they have never done before. And yeah, that's what everyone was speaking about, but that is just more that they have had to do in order to make this one a bit complete better at that point. Not just a lot of them, but just, just a little bit more. I think I haven't done this one at the time of its start. Twenty seconds left in the fourth quarter. No good for Booker. And they need to stop the clock, so there's a foul. That's right. No other Suns foul number 22, DeAndre Ingen is second. At a line for two for Philadelphia. Number 14, Danny Green. Take a break. Take a break. 
Two shots. And it looks like Philadelphia is going to tie the series up. Good on the first, and that puts them up by five. Sometimes when a guy is the 46th pick, as Danny Green was back in 2009, he can become an afterthought. But what does he go out and do in just his fifth NBA season? He wins a championship with the Spurs. Well, we know this. Free throw shooting is such a mental aspect of the game. This guy keeps his composure and comes through. Roger finds it. Free! DeAndre! Eating! I'm out Philadelphia. And the 76ers call time here. They're in front by three. Seven seconds left in the game. Shooting two at the free throw line. The hurry one, step hurry. Stop the clock at 6.0 seconds. First free throw is good, and that gives them a four point cushion. If he makes it again, then the Sixers win that fourth game. So he goes two for two at the lock, and it's a five-point game. Well, you love a guy who gets himself to the line, takes his time, and makes the free throws. Complete professional. So Philadelphia uh, so a narrow win under difficult circumstances, Greg, as the visiting team. It really was, but they didn't seem to bother. I mean, road team. 149 is your final they score. Better team. Well said. And that about wraps it up. For Greg Anthony, Doris Burke, and David Aldridge, and the rest of our terrific crew, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Have a great evening. So that's it for this game. Thank you so much for watching for this part of the video. If you'd like to check out the previous game of game, game three of the Suns vs. Sixers, you can check out that time if you'd like to see the previous one. Or unless if you don't, then you could watch game one and two of Sixers vs. the Suns in Philadelphia. Well played deserves here, here at the Phoenix, but they will be back here again in game six to do it all over again to bring it up once more. And right now for the next game, it is now tied up 2-2 in the series. Looks like the Sixers are trying to advance their way and they wanted to crush someone to try to pick up the pace. Well, there might be some solution if there's a chance to keep an eye on them. So, I like to, uh, I like to say thank you all for joining us here for this game. I hope this turns out to be the best time that ever happens here before, and hopefully we'll try again here in Game 5. At that moment, these out bitches for as a while as the NBA Finals dial, and we'll see what happens if someone takes the lead first. So that being said, I'm out of here. Bye-bye, Philadelphia. Or no, Phoenix, duh. Bye-bye in the Valley. And stay tuned, see you at Philly for the next game of Game 5. You've probably heard how Tony is so famous. In fact, you've probably heard how Tony was the greatest. I'm black and proud, honestly, I'm fateless. But y'all whack clown smirk, y'all think I'm faking. But truth be told, y'all turds, y'all just hate. And y'all yearn for rooms is gold in my rankings. All y'all fakest, haters, traitors, y'all are Satan. Y'all keep saying y'all will make it, I'm still waiting.